My name is Josh Mandel, and I'm a professor of molecular biology at UT Southwestern Medical Center. The research that my lab conducts that's supported by our CPRT grant um, is focused on really understanding mechanisms through which um, the genes in our cells are controlled. And um, we're very interested in understanding at the molecular level how genes are turned on or turned off. And traditionally we think about genes making, uh, ultimately making the proteins that make up our cells. The genes provide the code for the proteins in our cells. And um, what happens is genes are encoded in our DNA and they're copied into a molecule called RNA, which is an intermediate. And the cell is able to read the code in the RNA and turn it into a protein. What we've learned over the last several years is that there are some genes in our genome that don't make proteins. They actually, the end product is the RNA, which is the intermediate of those that make proteins. We call them non-coding RNAs. And these non-coding RNAs, um, they function to regulate the genes in our genome that actually make proteins. And so what we've learned is that in cancer cells, these non-coding RNAs are often um, abnormally expressed. In other words, their levels are abnormal, so they can be turned on too much or deleted from the genome when uh, cancer cells form. I think that in order to really achieve the goal of that we all share, which is to develop new therapies that are effective for you know, the thousands and thousands of people that um, suffer from cancer. Research is the fight against cancer, to, and it's the only way we're going to achieve that.